What's up everybody, Jason back here once again with another diecast review tonight. I'll be reviewing the 2011 Matt Kenseth Affliction Live Fast Crown Royal Ford Fusion for Roush Fenway Racing. Before I get to the diecast, let's go over the packaging. On the top of the packaging right here we have Roush Fenway Racing established in 1988. Lionel NASCAR Collectibles, the official diecast of NASCAR. 124 scale stock car, limited edition adult collectible. Side of the box here features the Roush Fenway Racing logo once again, the NASCAR hologram, action racing collectible still the choice of champions, and the artist rendering sticker that says please drink responsibility or responsibly. Side of the box features 2011, the Platinum Series logo, action racing collectibles, and the DIN or production sticker that says Matt Kenseth, number 17, Affliction 2011 Fusion, one of only 625 produced. This particular car is DIN number 40 side of the box here features the details of a 2011 Lionel NASCAR diecast so if you'd like to uh, read this feel free to pause the video and zoom in and all that stuff if you'd like and read it side of the box here features once again the artist rendering sticker and action racing collectible still the choice of champions so that is your box and here is the diecast it's a really good looking diecast a black car, either gloss black like this or matte black car, really looks really good. Matt Kenseth always has driven a, re a really good looking die uh, car. So let's start off on the front. We have the Ford Emblem Infusion. We've got the number 17. Up on the hood, we have Affliction, Lift Fast, and Crown Royal. Go ahead and open up the hood for you. There is your engine detail. Really good engine detail on the 2011 and... 2012 cars and then of course we all know what happened in 2013 inside of the hood we have the affliction logo and k and n for contingencies on the front bumper here we have goodyear gatorback belts moog molly comp cam edelbrock je sunoco and ray bestus we got goodyear both above both front fenders of course once again no special detailing on the wheels at this time contingencies on the door here we have nascar sprint cup series Coors light pole autometer jegs canon usg mechanic wear holly high performance carbs and 3m and we have the nascar race car logo up on the roof post we've got the number 17 with the uh, jack position right here contingencies on the back we have valvoline uh international trucks mac tools Champion spark plugs and Dupacolor. And actually, that's Freightliner, not International Trucks. Excuse me on that. We have Matt Kenseth up here on the roof row, number 17 on the roof with the bubble cam featuring functioning roof flaps, of course. Got Ford and Crown Royal on the B post, nothing on the C post except down here on the quarter panel. We have Affliction and Crown Royal, please drink responsibly with American Ethanol up here on the quarter panel. Back here on the deck lid, we have that affl Affliction logo once again and DIN number 40. Back here on the rear bumper cover, we have Affliction, which is afflictionclothing.com. Roush Fenway Racing, the number 17, and Ford with the simulated exhaust sticking out the back. Deck lid opens up nicely to reveal the detailed red fuel cell. Passenger side of the car, exactly the same except for the exhaust tip sticking out of the rocker panel. Car being that it's platinum feature, full working steering. Here's uh, the bottom of the detail of the chassis. All four tires roll. So that's a really nice you know deal with the platinum series cars. So yeah, that is my review of the Matt Kenseth 2011 Affliction Clothing Lift Fast Crown Royal number 17 Ford Fusion for Roush Fenway Racing. Be sure to give this review a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I post new diecast reviews weekly. Click the bell for notifications. Don't want you missing out on any of those weekly diecast reviews. Be sure to visit me on social media. I'm always there to connect with you guys. So visit me at JasonAStrange69 on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. The direct links will also be in the About tab above. Thanks for watching. Have a great night, everyone. See you next week for an all-new diecast review. Bye.